Okay, we're going to look at using the quadratic formula to find the roots of x squared minus 6x plus 2. On this calculator, you have to go into a different menu called equation function. We go in there, we need a polynomial, second degree, we put in our coefficients of 1, enter, negative 6, enter, 2, enter. Hit enter again, and out come our roots of 3 plus square root of 7 and 3 minus square root of 7, which is really nice. It's got the square root in there, the third. And here we can also convert it. We can go back and forth, get an approximate value or the exact. Very cool. TI. You don't have to go into a special, well, I guess you do. I take it back. You're going to go shift, polysolve. So, yes, definitely a different menu or mode. Go into the first, put in our coefficients. They're already in here, but normally I would hit clear. One, clear, negative six, clear, positive two, solve. And we get our roots, our first root and our second root. However, there's no way to convert them. So they are only available in approximate mode. Sharp, similar to the Casio um, in function overall and we're going to go into mode number six. We're doing a quadratic. We put in our coefficients of one, negative six, and two. And we get our two roots on the screen at the same time, which I like that. Um, no way to change it, though. No way to get the exact values. So the winner of this round is Casio.